Welcome to Travel Market Life, your companion for industry insights and professional business development. Travel Market Life. Join us by webcast, video or podcast. Hello and welcome to Travel Market Life for the pre-IHCF 2023 conversations. We're speaking to executives that are going to be giving presentations and some of the sponsors about what to look forward to at this year's event. We're going to be talking to Roger Tabal, VP Global Guest Technology and Innovation at Accor, who will be presenting on the topic, the evolution of digital check-ins and key cards. What exactly do our guests want? Travel Market Life. Joining me right now is Roger Tabal, who is the VP Global Guest Technology and Innovation at Accor. Thanks ever so much for joining me, Roger. You're going to be talking about the digital check-in experience, which we've had huge changes over the last few years uh, around digitalization and how guests really engage with the hotel as they arrive. Love you to tell us a bit about the journey that Accor has been through to implement digital check-in across the portfolio. Yeah, first of all, thanks, uh, Ryan. I'm very excited to attend the IHDF. Uh, and uh, we are for sure will have uh, a lot of uh, exchange and feedback uh, during the, the session. So for to answer your question shortly on digital check-in, uh, we've been, the, so the guest journey was broadly defined to include a lot of interactions with the hotel after booking and not just the online check-in. And uh, this includes upselling, pre-registration activities within the hotel or surrounding areas, uh, request to hotel staff, check out and so on. How did you develop that strategy? And I guess the other thing is you've got digital check-in. How much farther have you got to yeah. go uh, for, for really um, getting that full customer journey uh, strategy in place? Very good question, Ryan. So the most important for us is in tech is digitalization and frictionless interaction. Uh, and you know now that, that the uh, rising digital maturity across all industry is also reshaping the expectation. Uh, guests no, no, no longer compare their experiences with only the direct uh, rivals. They, they're creating the seamless end-to-end -end journey within hospitality that guests uh, have to, to expect from other industries increasing uh, depends on technology and data in the hotels. We were still, at the, I think, in my opinion, we're still at the beginning of the journey. There are a lot ahead of us to do in, on, on, this, on, this, on this topic, but we are, we are heading there and we are reaching there slowly. Uh, so that's my opinion on and the strategies that we follow. Just to add last point is the cloud and the most important for us, whatever we do, we do it on cloud based. So that's the core strategy and vision toward 2025, where we move all our core applications to cloud. So whether we do the online check in or other solutions, everything we do is a cloud based solution. Lovely. Thank you. And I mean, I spoke to your colleague, Kevin Fasu last year, who was at the IHTF 2022, and he was talking about your PMS strategy and that necessity, as you say, to be on the cloud and have your technology infrastructure all well integrated and connected throughout the properties. Um, now, when it comes to selecting the, um, the, the, the systems that you need as part of the customer journey, what are the key criteria um, and, and, and how do you identify uh, the right partners for your yourself? Uh, normally, we work in, in, in cooperation with our digital factory team. So we are in tech and there are digital factories. So both of us, we uh, work on assessment, on evaluating all the vendors that we work with. This is in, in brief. I, can, uh, I'm, I will share more details during the, uh, uh, during the event for sure, uh, just to keep a little bit of excitement for the guys. Absolutely. I think that it's about the presentation, what we're going to get at IHTF in uh, Vienna this year. For the uh, presentation that I'm going to use, I'm going to a little bit give a uh, flavor of what Accor is doing in terms of digitalizing the guest journey. Uh, we have Accor Key uh, uh, project, which we started in 2020, and we have really sailing well in this. We have a lot of hotels uh, uh, already on using it, and we have a big plan to continue the rest of the of the rollout and deployment uh, also would be sharing some insights on some prototypes and proof of concept that we are running uh, without of course without breaking the confidentiality or any uh, leaking any data from uh, a project which has not been really officially announced but i will try to give you some some uh, insight on this one uh, what will be the value in the in the uh, during the ihtf 
first of all, for sure, meeting new people, discussing hospitality, innovation topics, and finding solutions for challenges, like we do with every event where we meet with our uh, uh, counterpart and colleagues and friends and even partners and vendors. We talk about innovations, we talk about challenges as well, and we, we talk together about how we can find solutions for these for this, uh, this problems. Also, it will help us to get insight on the future direction of the industry and how technology is transforming the hotel industry by enhancing guest experience to increase the revenue and the operation efficiency. I know you're, you're giving me something that to taste on and to savor up until the end of March when we get to meet in person there. And you're so right, Roger, the, the level of the presentations, the quality um, and the insight that you get is really phenomenal because, you know, you are speaking to your colleagues, you are hearing from your colleagues who've actually implemented a lot of these strategies, um, identified new technologies and tech stacks and really moved forward in the digitalization agenda so if i got as much as i got from last year i think this year um is is certainly going to be incredibly insightful and i, I look forward to you sharing a little bit more than you've been able to share with us so far today i will do for sure i promise i will do hope <laughs> it's not too cold in vienna but i will do let's hope not uh, roger thank you ever so much for joining me today thank you so much ryan travel market life this year's IHTF is already shaping up to have a fantastic program with a lineup of speakers from some of the most renowned and recognized hotel brands and portfolios across the world. These include Kapinski, Pestana, Nordic Choice Hotels, Melia Hotels, Radisson, Best Western, Design Hotels, amongst many, many others um, across the three-day event. So we look forward to seeing you there or catch up on the content on the LinkedIn Live show on the event, as well as a podcast following. Thanks for listening. I'm your host, Ryan Haynes. For more, go to Travel Market Life. The music sensation by Zach Nelson is reproduced under license from Storyblocks. Travel Market Life is a Haynes Marcoms digital marketing agency production serving the travel and technology industries.